Hello everyone. Glad to be able to meet you again in this new year. And now let's just continue with our RPG combat system. So in here I would like to share to you guys how am I create collision for our character's weapon because we are using kind of melee attack character and then in here i'm gonna use anim notify state instead of creating a box or spare collision inside my character's blueprint and the reason is that because for me personally anim notify state gives me a freedom to decide when how long and in which animation i'm gonna use it so um first of all I'm gonna create a dummy for our enemy. So I'm gonna just using um, the third person character, the, the mannequin one. And don't forget to delete the camera for the dummy. And after that, let's um, just randomly put our mannequin into our world. So in here, when we play it, we see our dummy over there. And then the next thing I would like to do is I would like to create an anim notify state blueprint. And then I'm gonna rename it as um, melee attack. And then I'm gonna open it. And in here, I would like to override and I would like to choose um, receive notify thick and this is what we got and then in here I would like to call socket location and then I would like to spear trace by object the first socket location would be the start point and then the second one will be the end and then as for the world context object would be our mascom and over here, I would like to do branch. And if it is true, it will go to the return node. And then as for the radius, I would like to randomly um, pick a value. So let's see, um, 20, I guess. And as for the object types, I would like to make an array. And here I would like to choose pawn. As for the draw debug type, I will choose for duration. Okay, and for the socket locations, in this case, because I use Quang, so I would like to use um, FX weapon base and tip. Okay, it's done for the collision. And now what am I gonna do? I would like to go to my primary attacks montages. Here I would like to show you the implementation in the primary attack A. So let's pause this. Um, in here, inside the notifies, I would like to add a new tract. And then I would like to right click and add notify state. Then of course I'm gonna choose melee attack and I'm notify. Here. Um, and I would like to search for the correct timing. So maybe right over here. And then just stretch it. Okay, now I'm gonna do the same thing for the rest of the animation. Okay, now let's toss it up. It works. So, um, if 
the spare collision is colliding with the pawn, the line's color will turn into green. So let's check this out with our dummy. And yes, it, it works. As you guys could see over here, there are green lines. So our any notify state is working pretty well. And yeah, that's all. <laughs> it's quite fast. And um, I'm gonna play around inside the anim notify state later on for applying damage and stuff. And so I would like to leave it like what it is right now. And in the next episode, I would like to talk about how I set up an area of evac or AOE for Kwang's special ability. So, see you guys in the next episode. Bye bye!